Hey guys, this is Jam of Jamonline.ph and today we got here the Oppo Find X5 Pro. So this is the newest smartphone from Oppo and yes, this is a flagship one and I can't wait to unbox this smartphone. So as you can see in here, we got here the 12 gigs variant and 256 gigs of internal storage. It runs on Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor but unfortunately, this one isn't coming to the Philippines. Aside from that, we also got here the logo pass of that because this one uh, is a fruit of the uh, partnership between Oppo and Hasselblad. So yeah, I'm really excited to unbox this one. So yeah, there we go. There's the Hasselblad logo along with Oppo. So time to open this one and we still got this sticker here. Actually, don't have a knife right now. So I'm going to use this one. There we go. We just remove the sticker. Let's open this one. And there we go. We got here the Oppo Find X5 Pro. As you can see here inside, we got here the jelly case and it comes with a smoke jelly case look. Of course, we got here the card pin for the SIM card tray. And of course, what the hell is this? This is a benefits you deserve. This is the premium service card. And of course, the safety guide and all. So yeah, let's place that one over inside. So we also got here the Oppo Find X5 Pro and wow. Look at that. We got here the white color. Looks nice. Looks like, uh, wow, this one is glossy, but I'm not sure if this one uh, attracts a lot of fingerprints. But I like that this one comes with a glossy look at the back. Of course, you got here the protruding camera. It's not, it's a contour over here. It's not really a direct um, protruding camera. It's more of like we got here a contour, contour, contour. It's actually nice looking smartphone. Of course, time to turn it on. We got here the curved display, but we're gonna talk about that later. There we go. I was able to turn it on. But first, let's check out what's inside the box. So as you can see in here, uh, we got here. There we go. Of course, we still got here the charger. There's the USB Type A to USB C cable. And of course, we got here the charger, the super book charger and yes let's see we got here the 80 watts charger that is pretty damn fast not the fastest one that we have seen but it's really fast but yeah you've seen what's inside the box now time to check out the oppo find x5 pro all right so we got here the oppo find x5 pro and look at that it's beautiful it's nice i like the display over here so first we got here the 6.7 inch ltpo2 display it's an amoled display it comes with that um 120 hertz refresh rate it supports hdr 10 plus and uh, it has a peak brightness of 1300 nits that is really bright as you can see right now and yes the colors are really nice just like the previous uh find smartphone from oppo and the display is large enough for my usage i mean it's a 6.7 inch display we also got here a 1440 by 3216 uh, resolution for this one so yes the resolution is crisp the display is crisp it's crisp it's really nice and it's for, protected by Corning Gorilla Glass Victor so as you can see here uh, the background is really complementing the colors of the display of the AMOLED display but of course we're gonna talk about that later but first let's talk about the hardware that we can find inside on this one so first we got here the white look at the back this one is really solid really premium I really like the feel uh, the back of the smartphone so as you can see in here again we got here some protruding camera over here but unlike most smartphones it's more of a contour like that Okay, it's also powered by Mari Silicon NPU. It helps in the image processing in videos and photos for the smartphone. Um, it's a really big help when it comes to taking videos and taking photos on the smartphone. But yeah, we got here the triple lens camera setup. It's a 50 megapixel main camera along with a 13 megapixel telephoto camera and also a 50 megapixel ultra wide camera. So yes, you don't need a lot of lenses for your smartphone. You just need those three to make, you know, a better uh, camera you no know, to have a smartphone that can take photos that are, that can take really good photos and videos all right so below we got here the USB type C along with the speaker grill and yes that is uh, glossy over on the side it's made of aluminum I believe or steel I'm not sure but this one is 
rock solid. I'm pretty sure that this one is rock solid. I've been holding it. I really like the feel of this one. The ergonomics is really perfect. I mean, the curves on the side, curves over here, the rounded edges does really help in the ergonomics of the smartphone. And again, we got here the curved display on the front. On the right, we got here the power button and of course on the other side we got here the volume rocker again for the display this one is a really beautiful display i like the curved display over here it's really pleasing to the eye i mean the colors are really nice whether you want to use it uh for taking photos videos checking out media files or you know just checking out uh some games on the smartphone i'm pretty sure that you would uh, have fun um using the oppo find x5 pro so as you can see the software running it at let's see in here it's running on the color os version 12.1 we got 12 gigs of ram of course uh, you can expand that ram with ram expansion on up to plus 7 gigs of course that 7 gigs will be coming from the storage of the smartphone which is the one that we got comes in 256 gigs of internal storage but for now i'm fine with the 3 gigs i mean i'm not really into ram expansion but yeah it's a really nice addition feature to the smartphone of course, you got here the storage, 256, and it's running on Android 12. As for the software, as you can see in here, again, Color OS, we got some software uh, pre -inclu uh, included on the smartphone, including the Team Store. Of course, you got the Photos Assistant. Those are the Google applications, basically, over here. And of course, you got here the tools that you need. Um, we got the Clone Phone if you want to. You know, change your smartphone from one smartphone to uh, the Oppo Find X5 Pro, the screen lock, basically not much really a fan of this music party. We got Keep Notes, which is basically from Google, Quarter, Calculator, Phone Manager, Videos, Compass. Those are just the basic applications. A lot of these applications over here, up to here, can be uninstalled if you want. But yeah, we got here some application included like games. Um, that gives you a uh, more optimized performance when playing games if I downloaded games from the Play Store. But yeah, I'm not really uh, into that. I mean, I would play games on this one, but having a games application or a dedicated application for games is not really uh, something that I uh, really prioritize. But yeah, okay, there we go. We got here also the weather application, the files application, and yeah. There's a lot of things that are pre-installed on the smartphone, but you're probably curious with one specific feature, one specific application. That is the camera. And yes, the camera of the smartphone is really good. It's definitely something that you can expect from a 2022 flagship smartphone. Again, we got here the 50 megapixel main camera. We got here some easy uh, access to the settings, the aspect ratio, the timer, and everything. We got here the settings, of course, you could add a watermark, grid lines, and everything. So you can see, we could take uh, photos and videos at 10-bit color. So basically, get more colors, a better uh, shots on this one. Of course, HEVC for high-efficiency videos and everything. So yeah, there we go. So we got here the night mode. We also got here the video mode. We got here the photo mode, the portrait mode. And of course, there's a lot more uh in store for us with this one as we got a lot of features for this one all right so we got here the pro mode as well which gives us of course um the feel of a hasselblad camera but yeah overall uh it's not the best camera that i've seen it's on a flagship level sure it's great it's good but it's definitely not the best even uh for a flagship smartphone but yeah this one will do just fine and if you want to take videos as you can see you can take videos up to 4k not 8k as to as for uh the photos well do check out some of the shots that i took using the smartphone So there we go, that's uh, the Oppo Find X5 Pro. It's a really nice smartphone. 
yeah, we've got a really nice design. Actually, one of uh, the best design Oppo smartphones that we have seen. I actually like the back of this one. It's really cool. It's really premium and everything. And yeah, the camera is great. Not the best, but definitely great. The performance is Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor, something that you would really appreciate and something that you would really love. And yes, again, the display. The display, the display, the display. So good. So good. All right, so I guess that's it for our first impressions of the Oppo Find X5 Pro. So if you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and be sure to click that subscribe button along with that bell button to get notified of our latest videos here in my YouTube channel. So once again, I am jumpjumonline.ph. Thank you for watching and see you guys again in my next video.